what up y'all i don't even know where to start for real i don't even know where to start for real i don't even know where to start i don't even know where to start man <laughs> Y'all, yeah, y'all, y'all remember that? Y'all remember that giveaway I just did, where I said I'ma help this dude change his life. I'ma help someone change their life. You know, like I'm a mentor on my stuff, help him get fun and stuff like that. Then I said, you know what? I'ma give this dude a job, hands-on training. I'ma teach this dude everything, help him change his life. I felt for him, you know. He um, eviction orders on the door. I mean, not eviction orders. He said he was about to get evicted. Like, put all this pressure on me. But, you know, I said, you know what? I'm going to make it happen. I even got, like, an expensive rental. You know, got an exp expensive rental. He was about to get evicted in, like, two days, at least, he said. Um, so, I wound up getting this expensive rental. If it was up to me, I would have went with, like, Enterprise, got, like, a monthly rate, something like that. Um, I wound up getting a rider, rider rental. I'm charging me, like, a lot of money. But I know how to make money, so I wasn't really sweating it. I wasn't really tripping. Um, it backfired on me, y'all. Uh. It backfired on me. I helped this dude change his life, and it backfired on me. A day before my, my, my lady's due date. I'm up here near New York right now. You feel me? I'm up here near, near New York. I'm very upset right now, you know. Long story short, this dude, he, um, um, he, uh, I don't even know where to start. I don't even know where to start. You know, he 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 wanted he he said he wanted to be out on the road for two, three months. Um I paid for all his documents. New pilot jack, new equipment, new everything. I paid for everything. This dude needed every possible piece of information he needed. He had negative in his bank account. I helped him with everything. And that wasn't even in the plan. It was just free mentorship. I wasn't supposed to do all that, but I said, you know what? I'm a I'm a I'm a I'm a I'm a, I'm a do this, you know. Um, that's when, uh, y'all seen, I've been giving updates every week, the 11,900 in like 10 days. I went hard for this kid. Um, you know, like, you know, he, he know my girl due date yet tomorrow. You know, I picked up every phone call I was there from, spent like days going hard for this, this kid, man. Like, you know, I see he was the type of kid, like people would have took advantage for it, so took advantage of he was scammed by multiple people he showed proof to everything and i'm like you know scammed by a couple of them truckers i'm like you know what i see why people took advantage of him you know you know people think he's sweet and like he like gotta you know he come it seems like a very nice guy you know comes off as a very nice guy like seems like the type you get people to take advantage of so i'm like you know what i'm a i got i got you kid you know um, plus he was younger than me. A lot of people don't want to see the younger, the younger people win. I'm like, you know what? He younger than me too. I want to see him win. You know, I wish someone would have gave me that opportunity. You know, I ain't had nobody to help me. Not a soul, not a dollar. Nobody ever helped me. 17, 18, I had to drop out. I'm not going to get into my life story, but you know, so what long story, sh long story short, I'm going to just say like yesterday or yesterday he was supposed to drop off a little. Uh, we had like 2,600 in the truck. Wasn't one of our best weekends. Still was over $2 a mile. Picked up a little Arkansas, Memphis, third, uh, Friday. He, he he had to um, only get to New York. He had a 15-hour drive. Had all weekend. Could reset, you know, enjoy his days. Um, you know, he had all weekend. He didn't drop off till 2 p.m. He been was messing up. Um, he wanted to get home for his girl's birthday. I don't want to put his situation out there, but all he did was talk trash about this girl. I'm like, yo, you got to focus on you, King. You got to focus on you. I'm not going to put his whole situation out there. I'm not that type. Even when you do me wrong, I'm still not going. I'm not that type of person. This man that told me some stuff, but like, you know what? You just got to focus on you. Get your life together. Your girl got her life together. She making all that money. Boom. You know, focus on you. She focus on her. You know, get on your grind. Out of nowhere, he hits me with, I got to get home for my girl birthday. You know? Um, a week before, a week ago, um, I meet up with him. I meet up with him near in Philly, near Walmart. Um, I get a message on Instagram. His girlfriend says that, "Hey, this is, is such and such. 
And, uh, you know, I'm not going to put his name out there. But y'all been seeing him in the past video. So, like, y'all could do your own due diligence. I'm not, I'm not going to put his name out there. Like I said, I'm not that type of person. But y'all seen the videos if you've been watching. That's when, um, you know, the girl talked. Hey, uh, like, long story short, he, he got an argument with his girl. Like, broke the phone. I pulled up. I bought him a new phone. He was close by. I pulled up. Pulled up. Bought him a new phone. Um, that's when I had booked all them loads to Georgia. Y'all seen I did a video. I pulled up. I did my little video. Um, I booked all them loads. Got all that money in the truck. Um, I uh, bought him a new phone. All that stuff. I gave him all this advice. A couple days later, him and his girl get cool. Whatever. You know, like that's what's up. I'm happy for you. You know, stay focused. Long story short. Um, dude, long story short, today, this dude does me all the way wrong, bro. Like, this man, I told him yesterday, since he, it was 2 p.m., right? It was 2 p.m. Uh, we had, uh, you know, like, people think we don't ride compliant over here. I was pulling up with the ELD. I got the ELD in the truck, up in the truck. My other driver on the way to pick this up. I got my, I was, meet me up. I'm, meet, meet up with me. I'm going to put the ELD in the truck. It's okay. You messed up. Um, hold up. Sorry. Don't, don't worry about it. But, um, I'm like, all right, meet up with me. I'm gonna put the uh, put the ELD in the truck, and that's when um, that's when uh, you know, cause like it was 2 p.m. and you know, like not really loads coming out. Now it's all late. Like, like you know what? Meet up with me. You're not you're not far from Philly. I'm gonna put the ELD in the truck. Boom. Um, dude disappears all night, all night. Like I'm going through a lot. Keep in mind, like, I'm going through a lot right now. Like, like. I ain't even going, like, a little bit of what I'm going through, you know, my lady about to get birth tomorrow. Well, or tomorrow her due date. You feel me? He knows that. He knows that. You feel me? I never did wrong by him. I had his back the whole time. Then that's when uh, my, uh, I just was in a moving process. I had to move all by myself. My friends canceled on me. I need to help moving. We had to move last minute because the uh, my landlord, my, my not my landlord, the, the, the people that live under me kept smoking. They wouldn't stop smoking cigarettes. I kept asking them. They wouldn't smoke. You know, and I just, you know, I got a baby. I got to move. I got to move. And, you know, I feel like people be testing me. Like, I'll be trying to, like, just be very positive. You know, just be very positive, not let stuff get to me. Kill people with kindness. People be trying to take me there. But I'm like, you know what? It's all good. Kill people with kindness. So I'm like, all right, you know what? I had to move. He knows all this. Like, I'm in a moving process. And I got, like, a whole lot of other things. Like, right now, I'm supposed to be with my little sister today. It's her birthday. You know, she she lost her mom like like a couple couple days ago, like five years ago, lost her mom. And like I'm supposed to be with her right now. Like I'm supposed to be possibly in the hospital. Like my my my, my lady got to get birth. You feel me? Like, you know, I got a son. Like I got like you feel me? I got people I got to be there for. I got family. Like I worked hard to like be in a position. I shouldn't have to be here right now. Like I worked too hard to like be in this position right now. Like, And this dude like disappears on me, hits me up at three in the morning, like. My girl wake up. She, she she see the phone. He he sent a text, some crazy text. I forgot what he said. He said some stuff. Um, I'm on a, I got on a plane. He got on a plane. The trucks at the airport. He got the trucks at the airport. I had a family emergency. Family emergency. When I tell y'all, my heart started beating so fast. I felt like that Jones about to pop. My girl throwing up. Like you adding all this stress onto me now. Like I'm really like, I'm really getting mad now. I'm like really getting mad. Like, I couldn't sleep. I couldn't sleep, y'all. Like, I really couldn't sleep. I'm like, wow, like I couldn't sleep. Like you did me the worst, the worst possible way. Um long story short, because the dude's coming back, I'm about to have to pay him real quick. I gotta pay. Uh he he blocked the the uh where the tankers, they they gotta drop like ten thousand pounds in gas, like where the tankers they, they drop they gotta uh drop their load. Um thirteen hundred dollars is what I had to uh pay for this tow truck i gotta get this truck because this isn't one of them rider rentals you could just you know drop off at any rider i gotta pay like the miles the gas my other driver the flight for the for my other guy like five six thousand i tried to help someone out now i gotta spend five six thousand now on top of that i just realized i pulled up on a truck and the back of the door won't won't open this dude done fucked up the truck now i'm gonna have a clean Help this dude. This dude and left all his stuff. Look, I gave him a little B and A hat. Look, y'all don't even see exclusive drop. Pulled up on him. Exclusive drop. You mean like I bought him? I bought him all this stuff right here. I bought him everything. Everything. Look, he had a little gambling habit. Like I would give him all this advice. Like literally, I didn't judge him. 
I didn't judge him. Like, bro, I bought this dude with everything. Brand new pallet jack, brand new straps, brand new everything in the back of the truck, man. Huh? And then he got the nerve to ask if he could come back to the truck. Like, hold up, y'all. Look, y'all. Now the truck don't look. Y'all see that little cord up there? That's supposed to be hooked down. He messed up the truck. It don't open. It don't open. The truck ain't opening. Messed up the truck. Now I'm going to get a claim. You go to help someone out. You go to going hard for these people. And uh, I ain't going to say this is why like, I, I like, you know, like why you can't help people out because I'm not going to stop being me, you know. I'm not going to stop being me. I'm going to keep being me, you and know. With the, with the, but, did at the airport. That's not even it. That's not even it, though, y'all. Like, you want to get back in? No, I have to go to the bathroom. All right. That, all right. So, like, that's that's not even it. Then, then at the airport, I think I just told y'all, but, like, he he just left the truck there, dis disappeared, and didn't text me until he got into San Jose, California. You feel me? You know? I don't like now I gotta take like a five, six thousand dollar loss. I gotta I got a whole claim, like all this. And this dude just lied to me, like just like like literally just like like lied to me, bro. Like it's like you try to help these people out and they just they just do you wrong. Like really. Now now that I'm here at the truck, I'm realizing that he messed the truck up and he didn't want to tell me that. And you know, now I got a whole claim, all that, which is good. Though. I'm going to handle it. Like, it is what it is. But y'all seen, like, I was documenting everything, y'all. Like, I was showing y'all the proof. Like, I went hard. Like, right now, I got to, like, where the hell this shit at? Like, this right here, what I got to pay these motherfucking these motherf people right now. I got to pay $1,300. Literally, like, that could be, like, like getting donated, like, helping someone that need it. I got to pay $1,300. Because this dude leaves the truck in the middle of the airport and blocks where the tankers got to drop the gas off. Like, who does some stuff like that? Like, I help you. You know my girl about to give, go, go, like, tomorrow her due date. And this is how you do me. You know I got a lot going on. And this is how you do me. Like, I told him I was, like, busy the past couple days. So, like, I'm not really kicking it on, like, the personal tip because he would always call me. I would pick up his calls all day on the personal tip, be there for him, give him a lot of personal advice. But I said, look, bro, it's the next couple of days. Like, I got to move last minute. Like, my baby about to be here any day. I got a lot going on. I got, like, a lot of family deaths I'm dealing with. I got a lot of family stuff I'm dealing with. Baby about to be here. Like, you know, I got a lot going on, bro. Like, I'm going to just need, need a little bit of space. But, you know, I'm going to still get you loads. We still going to work. We still going to get the money. I just can't really talk too much on a personal tip till I handle my business. I got a lot of business I got to handle. You feel me? And and literally, like, dude, just like, man, all to go be with a girl for three days. Like, left me with a clean, messed up truck. All this stuff is still in there. Like, all this little suitcase I bought him. Like, stinking ass blanket. Like, all this stinking ass shit. I'm stinking ass jumbo. Like. I had to get that off my chest, y'all. Like, I'm in this truck right now. Like, just like, damn, like, I really helped this kid out. Now it's going to be a clean. I messed the whole truck up. So that's really why he left. Because he messed the truck up. Yo, you want to know something? It's a brand new truck, too. I, what I'm in right now is, like, only got... um, ele It got 11,000 miles on it. He got it at 800 miles. Dirty-ass kid. Like, really, like, dirty. Like, look at this. Like, like dirty as hell. Like... Like, dirty, dirty kid, like, like, I ain't even gonna say too much, y'all, it's like, but it is what it is, y'all, you know, you live and you learn, I'm not gonna stop being me, like, I'm like, really, like, I got a lot on my mind right now, and it's like, way more that this kid done did, like, I, I kept giving this kid chances, he would be late to loads, he's always complaining, he always say he gonna do something he's not gonna do, and it's just like, if I could go back in time, like I just like, which I can't, you know, I'd get an opportunity to someone else. But I thought I was doing the right thing. Like, dude, kid said he lost his mom. Dad showed proof to everything. Lost his dad, lost his mom. He about to get evicted. 
put the pressure on me. I'm like, you know what? I'm going to pay extra just so you can be in a rental and be able to, you know, have have a place to stay. And I'm going to help you get the money. And I'm going to help you with this. And I'm going to help you with that. And every time he called me, I came through, sent him a credit card, pay for every document. I sent him li- like literally everything. Like, that's how you do me. Now I got to pay, spend five, 6000 just to get the rental over there. And now I'm going to get claimed. I see that the, the, the truck don't even open up, so. Yeah, uh, it's like why you can't why you can't help people like, you know, this is why I teach people how to help themselves. That's why I teach people and mentor people and just teach people how to help themselves. I'm going helping somebody, I'm going above and beyond for somebody. And the day before my 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 girl due date, that's how you gonna do me. My girl can go into labor with me, like, like she, she I mean she can go into labor any moment, any moment. Yeah, hey, uh, so that's that's what I'm when I'm when I'm uh you know what I'm going through right now. Ain't nothing gonna stop me though. Like, you know, business is good overall. You know, my trucks is doing good. The lease don't care is doing good. Everybody doing good, but it's just this. You know, I tried to help someone out, get them an opportunity. All the way from the West Coast, I was trying to show y'all it's possible in Cali. Show y'all that it's possible. You know, I wanted to challenge myself and help someone out at the same time. You know, I got a baby about to be here now. I got to spend six thousand dollars in a clean because of this, this, this kid. Man. But yeah, uh, you know, if you believe in yourself, you can achieve anything. God bless. You know, you gotta keep your head up. You can't let this stuff get to you. Like one thing I realize in life is like, like a lot of people that go through like the things I, I go through, like they, like you, you can't let that, you can't let that frustration get to you. Like one wrong move, you know, it's it's over for you. One wrong move, it's over for you. So. You know, you got to, like, you got to keep your head up. You can't let that stuff get to you. Like, it's, 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 it's a lot of things going on in my life right now. But, like, just got to keep your head up. Don't let that frustration get to you. That, that's the devil. The devil always working, y'all. The devil always working. The devil always trying to get to you. The devil always trying to mess up what God got planned for you. One wrong move. You can work hard all your life, and all it takes is one wrong move, and it's over. I got to pay this dude this money. He coming to the truck. He coming about his money. He need his money. Yes, sir. That's me, man. Look, I ain't even. I'm not even going to waste your time. You said cash. Oh, you're right. I'm good. I'm frustrated no, here. No, 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 no. Hold all the money. cash. I gotta do all the paperwork. Oh yeah, you got. Yeah, you have your driver's license. Yeah, I'm, I'm about to come in there right now. All right, all right no problem. All right. all right, so I'm gonna get back to y'all, and I think the kid took the keys too, y'all. Like, man. How you do someone like me like that that went hard for you? I did everything you could possibly do for a human being. I helped you transform your life in every possible way. That's how you do me. It's crazy, man. It's all good, though. Message to that kid. I ain't going to expose you or nothing like that. You don't want to see me. That's all I got to say. Like, you don't, you don't stay out of my way. I wish you the best. God bless you. You don't want to see me. Just stay out of my way, man. Please. Me. I love y'all though. I appreciate all my support supporters. You know, I love y'all, man. I'm tapping with y'all later. I love y'all, man. If y'all just joined, just I'm, I'm gonna post the video up on my page. I love y'all. I gotta go spend this thirteen hundred to get this, you know, this tow. Stupid ass kid just put me in this position, and then I gotta pay another six thousand, and I gotta claim. It's all good though. I love y'all though. Appreciate all my supporters. Tabbing with y'all later. Believe and achieve. God bless.